co-speaker when we had a 30-30 tie. The responsibility for the people in charge is to run the government. That is the responsibility. You've got to get things to happen. When, when people don't show up like they didn't last week, you can't run government. And so from my perspective, the opportunity to have this bill on the floor today was, again, one of the highlights of my career. And I commend the leadership for figuring out how to get government to start working again. Because we have to do work. We have a lot of bills that are lining up. This bill is historic. And I am honored beyond belief for having had the opportunity to be one of the co-chairs in that. And, and the, the, the way it was put together, the way we were organized, the trips we took, the, the, the amount of latitude that the President and the Speaker gave to us to organize those meetings, to get to the right places, to make sure that every corner of Oregon was touched. What's really, really important for today is that what you saw on the floor was a demonstration how you can have a debate over a bill that's very contentious, but done the way the Senate should do it. And that is people giving their opinions, not taking pot shots at each other, uh, having an explanation of what it's going, and then take the vote. And it only happened because leadership here decided that being in charge means you have to govern and you have to figure out how to get people back in the building to govern. And I am more than happy. Uh, when, when you had a 30-30 tie, <laughs> neither one could blame the other because it would, had to be us. And I will tell you that it was very uncomfortable at times trying to keep everybody on track and making it work. When you have a majority, you have an expectation and you have people that have expectations for you, but you still have to run government. And that's not an easy task. It is an exceptionally hard one because you're managing, in this case, 30 people who are all independent contractors, all elected by their people in their own um, districts. Um, and people think that the president or the speaker or the majority leader have a whole lot of power, which they don't really have. It, we, we made government work because of the relationships we formed and other things. And these kind of situations destroy some of those long-standing relationships that make government work. And I, I am proud we were back. I was happy that Senator Bent said it's nice to be back. I, I, I hope and I expect that we won't have to deal with this again. Uh, every session, as they've said since I've been here, you have to go to a crisis before you can get on and get the work done. I assume this was the crisis and now we can get the work done. Because there's a lot of stuff Oregonians want from us. Senator Cordon.